Hey, this is Chad from Memphis Reptiles. I want to do a video and show off some of my new snakes I've recently acquired. This is a male black spin, which is a black pastel spider pinstripe. I got this from Carson Phelps at Herps Etc. It's a male, triple gene. I'm going to be breeding him next season with a few uh, normal females and possibly a few morphs. But he's a really cool guy. I don't see many of these for sale or even produced, so... I was really excited to get this guy. Then I have other new ones I wanted to show off. 2011 female albino and she's already pretty big. I got her from Leland Shaver at Leland Reptiles uh, out of DeQueen, Arkansas. He's a great guy. I've got this is my second snake I've got from him and he has really great pricing. Beautiful animals. She's shy. But she's a great eater. She's already ate frozen thaw for me since I got her home from the show. Probably going to be putting her with the black spin when she's up to size. Produce a lot of 100% het morphs and combos. And I'm really excited about this guy, guy. I've always wanted one. We did pretty good at the show on our leopard gecko, so I used some of that money to pick him up. He's a male hypo mojave. And I got him from Tim Bailey at Bailey and Bailey Reptiles. Tim's a great guy. He gave me a lot of great information. Uh, really nice to deal with. Gave me a super deal on this guy. And he's just smoking. I love the ghost flames. Mm, nice belly. I'm trying to get a few female uh, head ghosts and possibly some ghost morphs to raise up and breed to this guy later on down the line. This next season I'm planning on pairing him with my Leeson Black Pastel. And make some black magic 100% head hypos. I think that would be a nice snake. I love the darker morph, so I think that'd be cool. And I got another guy I wanted to show off. We got him a while back. Male Super Pastel. And he's already breeding size, I'm sure. He's on Frozen Thaw Smalls. Got a lot of nice blushing. Nothing really too fancy about him, but. I like him. It's my only super form I have right now. Probably just breed him with a bunch of normal girls and use him to back up my male bumblebee I got from Balls Out Ball Python. One of my females I produced last year, kind of interesting, that I held back from a pair of possible heads. Head for pods. I didn't get any pods, but produced this pretty cool female. And she's been eating great for me since I produced her. She's only one off. I think she might have missed one or two weeks of food and <laughs> really when she was in shed and she has a really nice ringer on her and she's real squirmy kinda hard to see with the lighting but she's got a nice white ring on her and that's it I just want to do a quick update and show a few of my snakes uh, thanks for watching please subscribe we're gonna do more videos we're gonna be doing some cut videos pretty soon and uh that's it for now. Thanks.